Hello, my beautiful Gemini's. Welcome to one of our special readings. Keep hearing over and over and over that there is urgent, important messages for you that's coming in at this time. And since I record these readings in the full moon in Pisces, it's closing a chapter, astrologically speaking, as the Pisces is the last zodiac sign, but also the most affected or the most privileged zodiac signs are those mutual zodiac signs, which one it's including you. Let's see, darlings, what we have for you and what are those messages that try to come in stronger, quicker, faster and definitely have urgency to come out. Gemini's, let's see, darlings. For some of you, it might even feel like a personal reading. For others of you, just will be here and there a message. Three of Cups underneath. Eight of Swords. Page of Pentacles. Justice. The Emperor, the Sun, and the Moon. Wow! Okay. So there seems here that the situation here is gonna switch somehow. But I feel here, whatever here is, hurts. Somebody here choose to end something. For some of you, you are going to end a relationship here with someone. Or someone is going to end a relationship with you. For some of you, you might not see that this person sees certain things the way they see. Like you, you feel like it's, it's not a big deal. It's like we, we get along. However, that's not the case. For some of you, it's you deciding this. Because you, you see yourself somewhere else or with someone else. Or you want someone else. Praying for someone else. I feel here, some of you, especially at night time, you could dream a lot about someone. This person is at the distance from you especially at night time you thinking of them or they trying to connect with you but it seems here that you you are not connecting as much with anyone than with that person could be you know mentally could be emotionally but i definitely see here you want someone in particular you feel like even though they are your twin flame Also, I'm hearing that somebody here feels this is selfish. The other one feels like I don't want to keep your life or I don't want to mess up your life. I do what I do for us, but it's not necessary for us. Like for some of you, there is a situation here that cannot go more beyond being just friends. Or you, you could get along here with someone very well, but... And they could love you, but you don't see them more than just a friend. Or there's some some kind of connection doesn't move beyond um, a level. Or it's very hard just to move forward. And it's kind of um, a torture for some of you just to to keep it or to keep it alive or... Or just feel like you trick someone or someone tricks you. Because some of you, you definitely deal currently with someone. First card, we have Ace of Cups. Six of Pentacles. Death. Yeah, for some of you, indeed, you are going to let go someone. Whoever they are. And it's not like you don't love them, but it, it's a different love. Because you could love someone, but you are not attracted completely on in, in, for them or into them. 
Ace of Wands. It's like it's more like attraction than love. Or it's more like I care about you, I am good around you, or I feel good around you, but it's not feeling that I I can live with you my life or all life. You definitely want to move forward. I feel also you've been thinking quite a lot about this. Six of Pentacles here. Was the Six of Pentacles. Six of Pentacles always speaks that things need to be balanced out. Or there's something here that can be balanced. If cannot be balanced, that will end eventually. Five of Wands. Could be certain arguments that comes over and over. And for some of you, there is a person here involved. Okay. Three of Swords. King of Wands. Yeah. There is certain wounds that cannot be, be cleared, cannot be you know, healed. I have two queens and a king and a page. Seven of pentacles. It's like, could pass even six, seven years and still kind of a relationship here doesn't go forward for some reason. Because Hangman speaks about the no movement. Although, with the Empress, this definitely can go through. Two of Wands. Somebody here definitely is going to make a decision to end a connection. Two of Wands. Ten of Wands. That's 12 weeks from now, which is three months from now. Which most likely by the end of the year. Things are going to get clear between you two was the death here temperance somebody here will feel like this is the right choice to do yeah and I, I don't feel it's you the one who is ending this but is the other person okay it's kind of I'm uh, hearing that this person want to be with you, but in a different layout because they feel like you you don't love them the way you loved the other person and they cannot live with someone who loves someone else. Might not be for many, but that's what the message I'm picking up. And, and they are right with the Ace of Swords. They know deep down they are right. And it's kind of they... They kind of make this amendments inside tower. Knight of Swords. They know you you might make certain decisions or you are gonna tell them I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that. But it's kind of too little too late. But also they feel like you you want your freedom. You want to go towards your person. They want you to, to figure out completely what you really want. And what you're looking for. Yeah. They set you free or they set themselves free. It's very hard for this person to let go. So for some of you, if there is kind of a, a very sketchy situation between you and someone or because I see you connecting here with someone, but there is someone in the background and this person, they want to be with you, but they more likely are going to let you go. So there's some kind of conversation that they are telling you tomorrow I'm moving or tomorrow I'm, I'm going to, to my parents or I'm moving to my parents or I think that's it. This is fair because things cannot go forward. And they might even say, oh, I set you free. 
do your life more beautiful than I could. Like this person feels like it's not like they're giving up. Whatever they do is because they love you. But one other note here is this person definitely want to be your person. They want a ring. They want to move forward. Or you are the one who want a ring from them, but they are not going to give it. Somebody here is not going to give a ring. And I feel also the situation is going on for some, some time. What else that's coming and it's urgent? For some of you, you, you might feel like, where did all this coming? Or how did you come up with this decision? But I feel here, this, this, this decision is, is not from a day or two, but is, is taking for some time. This person has been thinking for some time. Okay. This person, for, for some of you, this person might be in to some friends lately, or they might seen some uh, good friends, and they kind of came back like different, or you know, kind of, they are different. What else? Oof, Nine of Cups, Seven of Pentacles. Somebody here doesn't want to wait any longer. They just want to do other things. They want to just move forward. They want a family. Somebody here definitely want a family. And, and they want it now. For some of you, this person might even say, well, I found a better job and things like that. But this person definitely, they, they don't know why, why they do these things. But they feel this is the right thing. There's something here like you feel like, what is going on with you? Eight of Pentacles. They may tell you that I want to work on certain things. and But the fact is, there's other other situation they may feel like well give me six months i will figure out the thing is they have other plans you might not see this person i i don't see them yes they will tell you i free you i'm doing this i'm doing that but the thing is you know like um like the water is boiling 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 and then evaporating that's kind of a thing here this person was boiling inside a lot. And they wanted you to take actions, of course, and you probably didn't. Some Someone here needed to do something and they didn't. And this person, now it's on the go. It's, it's hard to believe that they will come back. What advice we have for you, loves? We have the Knight of Wands. We have the King of Pentacles. We have the Two of Cups. We have the Seven of Swords. For some of you, you may feel like you love two people. But I feel here, you definitely here want someone. But somebody here f feel like it's over. And Spirit says, don't hold back certain things. Because you could have someone and move forward with them. Don't doubt. For some of you, definitely someone wants a family. But if you are not going to offer it, they will walk away. Because they, they go forward towards what they really want. Absolutely. They actually want a chance. Deep down, they do want a chance. But they don't want to waste the time. And yes, they do love you. They do. And yes, they, they expect that, that, that offer. For those of you who 
don't consider that this person wants the real deal. They do. Okay, and Spirit says, if you are one the same, don't lose this person. Why you should not lose this person? Why you should not lose this person? Because you manifested each other and you could make a, a great couple. So think about it, loves. Think about it. Yeah, this could be the one. And could free you from some kind of past life energies, past life karmic energy. Wow, Gemini's. These are the urgent, important messages that's coming in through. I hope this resonates. I hope this speaks to you. And it does, let us know. And I'll see you next time. Bye for now.